Hello, today I'm going to show you how to securely erase a hard drive, solid state drive or NVMe M.2 uh, drive. Um, sometimes like say if you're if you're selling your hard drive or if the drive's faulty and you need to return it to the manufacturer for uh, a, a repair or a re replacement under warranty, you want to make sure that you securely erase the drive. Um, so what does secure erase mean? Um, essentially within Windows, when you click on format a hard drive, uh, it doesn't actually fully delete all the data on the drive. So if you had a hard drive that had a load of data on it and you clicked format and then you sold the drive or you handed it to somebody else, theoretically they could um, recover all the data that's on that drive. So what secure erase does is it um, essentially writes uh, zeros to kind of every block on the drive which um, simply put just means that the data is um, destroyed and cannot be recovered um, so to do this you need a program um, to basically run alongside windows when you turn your computer on um, with the software on it that you can actually use to secure erase the drive. Now, sometimes um, the hard drive, solid state drives, the manufacturer includes their own software um, that can securely erase a drive. Um, more often than not, the process to do this is you need a USB stick. I've, I've to put there preferably 32 gigabytes or more. Um, and what you do is you install a program onto the USB stick and then you'll restart your computer and load into that program under the boot menu um, and that's how you securely erase the drive but in this video here I'm going to explain how to do this um, for example if your uh, drive manufacturer doesn't include their own secure erase facility um, so the program that I'll be using today is called Parted Magic. Um, I'll just show you here, if you go on Google, Parted Magic, this is what the program looks like. Um, a a one-time uh, CD key costs $15, so that's what, about 10, 11 pounds. Um, and you don't get any updates with that, but to be honest, it's not really necessary um, to get regular updates for this program. Um, because I imagine it's not going to be very often that you wanted to erase your hard drive securely. Um, so Parted Magic is the program to erase the drive and then you need another program called Rufus and what Rufus is, is essentially it's a program that allows you to um, install an ISO file which in this case is the Parted Magic program. It um, properly ins uh, loads it onto your USB stick so that program's free. Um, so the steps to do this, you need to download Parted Magic and Rufus and then you need to open up the Rufus program. So this is what the program looks like when it's open. So you then need to install your USB stick into the computer and then select the device from the drop down box and then it will ask for this section here select that's the ISO file so you'd click that you'd navigate to where you've downloaded parted magic to and just click select and then you don't need to touch anything else you just click start and then what that will do is it will firstly erase the USB stick so a bit of a warning if you've got anything on that USB stick you need to take it off before this because it will wipe it and then it will flash the parted magic ISO file onto the USB stick so it can take sort of five ten minutes to do that and then once it's done it'll say this bar will be green and it'll say done and then you just close that um, then you need to turn off your computer I've put here remove all hard drives apart from the one that you want to secure erase now what this means is if you've got obviously one drive that you want to securely erase and only that one drive then I would highly recommend that that is the only drive that you leave connected into your computer so all the other hard drives solid state drives that are in your computer with your computer off obviously um, remove those drives unplug them from the power 
and the data cables. Uh, cables sorry. Um, so then with the USB stick plugged into the computer, you need to turn on your computer and start tapping the key to select the boot menu. So this varies by manufacturers. Um, it's usually either the delete key or the F12 key, but like I said, this does vary, so you will need to Google or look at the manual for your motherboard to see what the key is. So once you know which key that is, let's say it's F12, keep tapping F12 and then the boot menu will load up and it'll say what device do you want to boot from. So select the USB stick um, that you've got Parted Magic installed on and then a screen will pop up with a load of text and it's basically the Parted Magic program um, sort of loading all the files that it needs to boot. Um, it will ask you initially what type uh, you want to run like 64 bit 32 bit just hit enter you don't need to select this yourself just hit enter um, so once um, parted magic is loaded you will be presented with this screen here um, so within here you want to select erase disk you will then be presented with a window that looks like this and this is essentially asking what type of drive do you want to wipe so the top one Arta Secure Erase, that's for sort of hard drives, um, 2.5 inch SSD drives. And then underneath you've got NVMe Secure Erase, which is obviously for your M.2 NVMe drives. Secure Erase, then you'd select the second option. So once you click on either of these, um, the next window that will pop up will be basically asking which drive do you want to delete. now. On the right hand side here, display what drive that it's um, asking you to erase. So obviously you need to confirm that this is exactly the same as the drive that you do intend to securely erase. Um, if you're happy with that, then you click the tick icon. And at the bottom, there's a warning which says, um, I allow this utility to erase the listed device above. So obviously you're confirming that's the drive you want to wipe. Click that and then click start erase. Um, and then another window will pop up saying erasing, erasing the drive and then once it's done if it's successful it will say success formatting and then that's it. Um, I do sometimes like to erase the drives a couple of times I usually do it two or three times um, if you are erasing a traditional spinning hard disk hard drive disk depending on the size this can take um, an awful long time. For example, if you say you wanted to wipe a 10 terabyte hard drive disk, then you could be looking at a couple of days. That's how long this program can take. But if you're raising a SSD or NVMe M.2 drive, then it usually raises the drive in about three, four seconds. Um, so yeah, I like to do it uh, a couple of times if, if I'm erasing a SSD. Um, obviously it has to be said prior to doing any of this the data on the drive will be erased and you will not be able to get it back um, so you do have to be a hundred percent sure that before you start this process you're happy you've got the data off the drive that you want you've got it backed up and you are happy to erase the disk obviously by bio making this video I accept no responsibility or liability if you happen to do this um, and you realize afterwards that there was something on the drive that you needed some data uh, you know likewise if you once you start erasing the drive if you cut the power to the drive then the, the drive will be locked and you will have to unlock that um, I will cover that in another video but you will not be able to continue the erase um, of the drive unless you do unlock it so um, yeah obviously you have to follow the instructions on the programs um, which I have noted on here um, but yeah so I hope this video has been of use uh, please like and subscribe for more content and if you have any questions or comments please post them in the video thanks very much have a great day